いまだまだ力が及んでいないことは承知していますそれであの今日は私の方で道具を用意してみたのですがこれなんですけど使ってみてよろしいでしょうかな、なわ Greetings. Today I'm going to talk about a wholesome cultural anime. If you like vanilla and romance, then you should watch this anime. If you don't know where to watch it, Google and Incognito are your best friends. The main character, Akazaki, is currently working as an editor for a manga company. It is not your typical manga, it is a cultural manga. He stated that he loves to read cultural manga for the plot, and he has a lot of experience in them. Before that, the company has a top tier editor, Fujita. However, he left the company due to capitalism, so the company hired him despite not having any job experience. Fortunately, Fujita is willing to help him out to learn the ropes before he left the company. Fujita san wa satte itta. コミックボトムを生かすも殺すも俺次第これからは俺なりのプラスアルファを加えていかないとと意気込んでいた俺に藤田さんからメールが来た。Then, Akazaki is very determined to make the best cultural manga. One day, he received an email from Fujita, and he wants Akazaki to work with him at a famous company. Akazaki knew that this is a lifetime opportunity, and he doesn't know what to do. After thinking for a long time, he chose to decline Fujita since he wants to make his own cultural manga. Ah, <sighs> 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 ここから理想のエロ漫画雑誌が生まれるかもしれないのだ。俺の手で。俺の作る新生コミックボトムの本格指導だ。ほほ、ずいぶんとやる気だね。ああ、編集長。After that, the editor in chief came to meet him. She noticed that he is very enthusiastic, so she decided to give him a reward for working hard. Then she starts to clean his Excalibur the climate friendly way. He did not see that coming, but he will be coming later. After a while, he gave her some protein rich snacks, and she left him without saying anything. I guess that is a win win situation. By the way, I gave the editor a lot protein rich snacks too. Moving on, he knew that this company is going downhill. Therefore, he needs to do something or this company will go bankrupt and his dreams will be shattered. There are four employees there, and all of them are female because women are strong and independent in 2024. He is going to help all of them to improve themselves. まずはボトムの看板の、早部アルルこと、綾部ハルルさん。絵も内容も確かに悪くはないんだけど、推しとか、花とか、エロさとか、そういうものが足りない。とりあえず、俺が今特に強化したいのは、この三人だな。He chose the first lady, Haru, who is a manga artist. Then he is having a one on one meeting with her. He informed her that her cultural manga is not cultural enough. She told him that she is just using her imagination when drawing the manga. However, since she does not have any real life experience, she is having difficulty projecting them onto the manga. <laughs> She wants him to help her to overcome this problem, and she needs some inspiration. Without any hesitation, he immediately helped her out for work purposes. He is using some holy relics on her, and don't worry, those are safe for work. He keeps helping her out whenever he can. Sometimes, he even rewards her hard work by giving her some fresh organic protein shake. After a few months, he is very impressed by her work. He praised her for improving her drawing a lot compared to last time. Therefore, she can continue with the cultural scene in the manga. However, she still has more to learn, which is the dungeon exploration. She also knew that, so she took out a rope and gave it to him. So, I'm going to show you the rope. 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 It seems like she wants him to give her more inspiration for her cultural manga. Without further ado, he used the ropes on her and starts to explore her dungeon for work purposes. Eventually, he pumped a lot of newfound inspirations in her, and she is very happy after receiving that. I guess she is the same as the editor. Anyways, although she has received a lot of inspirations, she told him that she might need more in the future. Moving on, this means that he has solved one of the issues of this company, and he is going to solve the next one. He chose the operation manager. Now, it seems like she is not cultural and does not have any cultural knowledge. When he is discussing about that with her, she told him that she doesn't understand the characters at all. Then, she told him that she might want to see someone's solo let's play. Therefore, he starts his solo let's play in front of her, and she is watching his live stream in 4K. 
However, despite having a hard time, he is having a hard time on his solo Let's Play since she is watching him without any reaction. She noticed that and decided to help him out. However, her help has no effect since she is pretty bad at that. He is so done with her, so he is going to give her some consolation prize. He knew that his protein blast skill gauge is going to be full, so he asked her to come closer to his Excalibur. After that, he gave her some organic all-natural facial therapy. On the next day, when he is at work, she suddenly spawned under his desk and starts to clean his Excalibur the eco-friendly way. He is very surprised and has no idea what the hell is she doing. She told him that she has read some cultural manga and she is just mimicking the girl in the manga. In addition, she wants to deepen her cultural knowledge. She assumed that he would be into this shit, and guess fucking what, he is actually into this. After that, the editor-in-chief came to meet him, but she still continues her eco-cleaning. <laughs> Although he was not busted, he has busted some protein into now. After that, she told him that she needs to be more cultural. So, she is going to play the game of the year, Bouncing Simulator 2024 Work Edition with him. No protection is used because everything is safe for work. During their gameplay, Haru came to meet him, and she found out about their gameplay. She is shocked after seeing that, and she decided to resign from the company. <laughs> ハルルさんから連載の打ち切りを告げる一通のファックスが届いた。携帯電話は解約され、マンションは引き払われ、連絡が取れなくなっていた。看板作家の抜けた穴は大きく、ボトムは売り上げを落としていった。そして数ヶ
ちょっとハルルさん After half a year, her cultural manga is finally published, and he told her that they received a lot of order. She is very happy after finding that out. Then, she thanked him for helping her and believing in her all this time. He is the only reason she can go this far. Then, she told him that she plans to change her last name. I guess she will be changing to his name. Now, that is a wholesome good ending right there. For the next route, he will be choosing Kaori. It looks like her problem is kinda similar to Haru. He told her that her drawing does not look cultural enough. Therefore, she wants to see the real genuine Excalibur. He showed it to her for work purposes. After that, she starts to feel the texture and shape by giving him some helping hand. Her inspection caused him to use Protein Blast. Then, she wants to deepen her knowledge even more. Eventually, she wants him to explore her dungeon. He rejects her and told her that she should not sacrifice herself for work. However, she told him that she is fine with that. So, they did some protein time during work time to boost their efficiency. Ever since that day, they did a lot of protein time, and she has received a lot of inspirations every time. One day, she told him that she wants to work on her manga on her own, and she no longer needs his help. I guess she is going to be independent after all. When he is feeling down, this lady, Shiraishi, came to meet him, and she invites him to have a drink with her. Since Kaori is the one who wants to be alone, he does not care anymore and accept her invitation. When they are drinking, he told her about his story. Then, she suddenly gave his Excalibur some aim assist, and told him that she can comfort him now, since his Excalibur is ready for battle. He accepted her offer without thinking much, and did the protein time. During that, Kauri walked onto them, and as usual, she is shocked after seeing that. Therefore, she decided that she couldn't draw anymore. Odagiri-san! <laughs> This means that he has reached a bad ending. So, he is back to the time when he was invited to a drink. This time, he rejected her invitation. After a while, Kauri came to meet him. It looks like she rushed here to meet him. She told him that she wants to show him her draft. After looking through it, he is amazed by it, since this is the best one she has drawn so far. After that, she told him that she needs him, since he is the one who helped her get this far. Then, as the standard operating procedure, they did some wholesome protein time. Ever since that day, they kept having protein time all the damn time. Thus, her drawing is improving from time to time. However, she is embarrassed since the characters in her manga looks like both of them. Well, I know they are Asian, but that is not the case. Anyways, he assumed that she might be embarrassed to show the world about her fantasy. <laughs> いや、他ならぬ彼女の恥ずかしい妄想とか呪けを全国の読者に読まれてるみたいでより一層恥ずかしいよな。ところで、この漫画の感想、それだけですか？些細なこととかでも何でもいいから聞かせてください。え、えっ
Well, the anime ended right after she offered to clean his Excalibur the climate-friendly way. I guess that is a happy ending, right? Too bad we won't see the fourth character in action. This anime only has two episodes, and it seems like episode three will not be released anytime soon. These are the comments and feedback for this anime from a cultural website. So, what do you guys think about the plot and animation of this anime? Let me know in the comment section below after you watched it alone, or with your families.